When Mayan Ehe Yeshua Medical Center first opened its doors in 1990, the heart of the hospital was its commitment to quality patient care. And for over a quarter of a century, Mayan Ehe Yeshua has been recognized throughout Israel's medical community for providing the highest level of personal patient care. Mayan Ehe Yeshua, professionals with heart and soul. From its inception, Mayanei HaYeshua's philosophy has been to combine quality patient care with the highest standards of medicine in the spirit of halakha and sanctity of life. This is the essential factor that distinguishes Mayanei HaYeshua from other hospitals, and it is the key element in the vision of Mayanei HaYeshua's founder, Dr. Moshe Rothschild. I call the hospital Bet Refua. Bet Refua is a healing institution. You come out and you are healed. And what is the purpose of this hospital? Higher level medicine. We skip him the halacha and we counting the value of human life. The sanctity of life in the whole hospital is something very important. Maybe the most important. One of the first needs met by Mayanei Yeshua Medical Center was to provide high-quality care for newborn infants and their mothers. Today, Mayanei Yeshua is the only hospital that offers a three-day minimum stay for new mothers as standard, providing mother and child with exceptional care and extra recovery time. And Mayanei Yeshua has one of the most advanced neonatal intensive care units in the country. The infection rate in the neonatal unit is zero. Now that is actually unheard of. Uh, we are now celebrating uh, 365 days without central line associated infection. We believe that uh, it's also due to a very, very unique uh, nursing system that we started five years ago. The nurses are doing things with a lot of spiritualism. Uh, watching the baby and helping the baby to reduce stresses. When you reduce stress from babies, you improve dramatically the development of his brain. We cut down blood examination in 66% in five years. We don't need it anymore because they are all healthy. It's a way of thinking. We know that uh, we are the only NICU that uh, does it in that way. This reputation has led other hospitals to send at-risk new babies specifically to Mayanei HaYeshua for treatment. As the years progressed, Dr. Rothschild's original vision kept pace with the growing healthcare needs of the population in Israel. I work here for 25 years. Since 1990, I've seen this hospital grow in the past 25 years to a full-fledged medical center. The numbers are truly impressive. Today, Mayanei Hayashua has 15 medical departments, 35 outpatient clinics, 150 medical doctors, 280 hospital beds, 12,000 babies delivered annually, 51,000 annual visits to the A&E, and over a quarter of a million patients treated each year. My Yeshua is a hospital that sits in the community, for the community, with the community. I think the facilities that we have at My Yeshua, they're aiming for gold standard. It's not just your basic facility, they want to give the patient the best of everything they can offer. Because the needs of patients are a top priority, it is no surprise that Mayanei HaYeshua has the shortest waiting time among all of Israel's hospitals. And although Mayanei HaYeshua is not a specialized geriatric hospital, other hospitals recognize Mayanei HaYeshua as the choice for handling geriatric cases. Mayanei HaYeshua looks at the patient's needs, not at the patient's age. It's very important to know patients here in Mayanei HaYeshua they are, they are not numbers, they are persons. Mayanea Yeshua was once described as Israel's best kept medical secret, but not anymore. As we celebrate our Silver Jubilee year, Mayanea Yeshua is a fully fledged mainstream medical center. Under construction are our new cardiology building, 
and mental health building. Other new top-of-the-range medical services offered at Mainei Hayashua include a new high-risk pregnancy department, mammography clinic, cardiac catheterization unit, intensive cardiac care unit, dialysis center, and a mental health clinic. Up till now, it's been quite a stigma to have any form of psychological illness. But with the rabbinical support, men, women, and children have been able to attend the unit and to seek the help they need without any stigma attached for their future life. And I think that's vital. The fact that you are open with psychological issues means you can deal with them in a more effective way. Mayanei Hayashua is helping the Haredi community to break down stigmas and to become more involved in their healthcare issues. In terms of medical information technology, Mayanei Hayashua is leading the way. All our nursing staff use portable computers for on-the-spot recording of patient information, care procedures and test results. We also have an advanced electronic archiving system which will eventually be part of the planned National Healthcare Archive System. Once all the other hospitals catch up. Mainei Ayashua has successfully recruited a veritable who's who of former top department heads of Israeli hospitals and renowned specialists from across Israel's medical community. That's why Mayne Hayashua is a top choice facility for families seeking quality medical service for their healthcare issues. Little Mayor Yisrael Cohen Davidov was born with an undeveloped esophagus. His parents knew he needed a top pediatric surgery department to help save their newborn infant's life. After consulting with rabbis and medical professionals, we decided to go to Mayne Hayashua Medical Center. This is where we would get the best care, the best treatment. This is where we would feel the most comfortable. It was ideal for us. We made inquiries and discovered Dr. Orkin here at Mainei Yeshua. He is known as one of the country's top pediatric surgeons. Baruch Hashem, after four and a half hours of intensive surgery, he came out completely soaked in sweat and he calmly informed us that there was now an esophagus. There was an esophagus. That was the sentence that told us we'd made the right decision to come to my Yeshua. When he came out of surgery and told us there's an esophagus, it's a sentence I'll never forget. I'll have it with me for the rest of my life. He simply gave my child's life to me as a gift. It is this kind of life-saving surgery that has been part of the hospital's vision from the very beginning. Mayanei Hayashua's operating theatres already perform procedures in several key areas. Ear, nose and throat. Specialised orthopaedics. Pediatric orthopaedics. Urology and gynaecology. In the last eight years, we triple the number of surgeries here. But the facilities didn't grow parallelly. We are very, very busy every day, every morning. For instance, today we have four operating theaters working and we have more than 30 surgeries. It's a very busy operating theater. So we are reaching the point that we are not be able to meet the, the needs of the community, the surgery volume that we're having now. We would like to introduce ophthalmology uh, at the moment, we don't have sufficient operating theatres to encompass this. There's definitely a demand both in the local community um, and also for the wider population. It has a fully fledged an accident and emergency. But we've now appreciated that what's missing from there is to have an operating theatre attached to the emergency unit and have seamless care the ideal situation is if you need to operate in an emergency, you take the person from the A&E directly into the operating theatre. For the last 25 years, we have constantly had to try and keep up with the demand for our medical services. As we celebrate our Silver Jubilee year, we are reaching the point where our surgical capacity is no longer coping. Our most pressing need is to expand and upgrade our surgical facilities 
into a new state-of-the-art operating theatre wing. This is the next crucial step in providing quality care to our growing number of patients, both young and old. We are Maenei Yeshua, professionals with heart and soul.